Then I hit you once. I got you. Nick, sir. All right, just put in a bullfrog. It's another really nice day here early February. Uh, the plan is to head over to Halls. Caught about 20 or so there yesterday. We've got a few fish. We're going to chum those, see if we can't help the bite activate. Because we saw a lot of fish yesterday. We think we should have caught more. Going to go there, try there. If fishing's not on fire, might go try something a little different today. So that's the plan. I don't know. Keep watching. <laughs> I'll run you through. No, no, no. I'll run you no! through. Give me of your booty. All right. So we got here in the halls, and in December, down past that point, that's where we were. And then last week, and then yesterday, they're more kind of pulled back. There's a ledge that kind of runs all the way down the middle of the back of this bay. It drops from like 25 to about 41 feet. So looked like there was some right on the graph, right on the bottom of that secondary ledge. So we're gonna try to find that, start there. So we see schools on the bottom. But they're not taking our spoons. So we're gonna see if we can't chum up a few. After I said that, so you didn't know he was on. Uh, -uh I just said, "Oh, Corbin's on to do that the circle thing," and then he just gets a fish. Wow, uh, chumming from the hook. That that's a nice one. That's big. Yeah, that's not bad. Okay, my turn to use that bowl. Yeah, that might be the biggest one of the trip. Show me. Well, definitely is. Nice one. Wait, can I tell them something? Can I tell them something? Can you get a picture of me, actually? Yeah. Just need one from this trip. Was this on the bottom? Uh, I've been doing the kind of, not bumping against the bottom, but just a little bit higher. So, I think I'm a success with that. More Xbox, or more tackle boxes and less Xboxes. Right, exactly. More tackle boxes, less Xbox. Probably well, Henry Father doesn't want anybody to have an Xbox. Yeah, that's true. He also doesn't want BYU to win the national championship ever again. Probably not. Why? Because they've gone to the dark side. There's one. That one was kind of out in front. I cast it about 20 feet. Yeah? Oh, yeah. I need an idea. Wait, on the spoon? On a little blade, blade jig thing. You think it would work on the spoon? My camera's on you, by the way, bro. Dad, do you think it will work with the spoon? Or no? Or no. All right, there we go. Little striper. Old snapper. Old snapper. You call old snapper. Yeah. Threw that little thing on. Little blade jig. Thingy? I don't know.
Here, I'll put him in the live wall. Second fish of the day. Graph's looking really good, by the way, guys. Oh, just missed one. All right, so we spent the last couple hours here in halls. Seen some fish. We caught three, I think. Had a fourth one on. So, I don't know. Maybe it's just too calm. Maybe we need a little bit more wind or something. But it's not producing like it probably should. So we're gonna run up lake. We're I think gonna try something that none of us have ever done. So we'll go check that out. That one is, looks really good. Tender, and about ready to go. Okay, Pete, you ready? Oh yeah, go get your steak. Stop effing filming me, go get your steak. <laughs> How is it? Good. All right, <laughs> you're, you're done. <laughs> sure. Let me cut you off a piece. Just get another fork if you're worried about germs. You want me to 
cut it smaller? Yeah. There you go. I don't eat this one. <clears throat> Same as last time, but better. This is really good. What's well, better than a thin? All right, so we finished up our lunch, and now we're going to attempt to hike up the canyon and go to the Defiance House ruins. It's something we've seen on videos and stuff, but we've never even tried. So we figure fishing's a little off and we're not gonna get another chance. Uh, Cause we're always just fishing. So, all right, we're gonna head up there and see what it's like. Only one got through. Throw that one next to Nixon. Pretty thick, actually. A lot thicker than I thought. It's huge. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? That's a. Uh, it's an inch or so thick. Skip another one. Oh, that one. <laughs> Watch out! Yeah, I think that one. <laughs> yeah, I think that'll do. <laughs> got it. One skipped again! This is fun. Yes. sunglasses here. I have like no idea how to get all of these in one. Well, we finally made it. It wasn't that bad of a hike. We made it to the Defiance House ruins. 
in Forgotten Canyon. And the hike alone is awesome. This place is awesome. So beautiful. It's really one of those places to, it's kind of hard to capture all of it. But I was saying these, the main pictographs that this place is named after is so much bigger than I thought. I've seen them in videos and pictures and they always seem smaller. Those are like three, four feet high. They're really cool. What do you think, Nix? Cool. I wish you can go inside. Look at how there's the, you've got the lines going this way. Uh-huh. Like the, in the sandstone, and then you've got the, the swirls, ripples going yeah. that way. So cool. We're allowed to go down. Wow, the sun, uh, yeah, the, they, sun. the park service definitely built this ladder. Right. right. <laughs> but see that other down. one, I was wondering if it was a chimney, and it definitely is. Oh, this is a totally separate room. Dad, come down here with us. Oh, amazing how kind of small it is, you know, but. Yeah, I'm coming. No, look down the chimney thing. Come down here. This is cool, right? Man, I wonder if they like. I think this was a grinding thing of some kind. Yeah, like a, a right here. There's a, a mill. Look at how it's worn. I wonder if they like, did they build this up or did they dig it? It looks like they built it up. It looks like a wall. Oh, wow. Just beautiful. Well, we finally saw the Defiance House ruins, and they were really cool. I think they exceeded kind of all our expectations. Perfect weather, nobody else here. Nice and silent and calm. Able to enjoy these. It's just awesome, awesome. Very cool place. Start heading back. Yeah, I 
if you if you haven't if you're a pal enthusiast and haven't been here definitely recommend coming here and seeing seeing this canyon seeing these ruins and just hang out really cool in that one spot.